Kathy Hendricks is here. Kathy, hello. It is hello. so lovely to be here with you. This is our crock pot. Now we spoke before, didn't we? And, yes. you, and you said to me, you said, "Do you uh, do you know what a crock?" Yes, of course I know what a crock pot. Everybody who, you know, has to go out to work during the day or anybody who's got a big family, surely you know what a crock pot is. This is genius. It isn't just a crock pot. Because, you know, sometimes maybe if you've got a, a slow cooker or anything like that and you leave it on during the day and then you come home and you go, well, the middle bit's okay, but the rest of it's kind of stuck to the bottom of the pan. Not going to happen. This is is your amazing digital slow cooker with the eye stir stirring system plus you get a bonus little dipper that we'll look at yeah Kathy taught me through look okay. what's going on well, here do you see what's happening here so this is chilly and this is <laughs> it is chilly outside yes it's chilly outside <laughs> this is the time of year and when you are slow cooking you are cooking chilies stews soups but you can do so much more with your slow cooker as well. And what we have here is a stirring mechanism. So now all you need to virtually do is prepare whatever recipe you want to make. And then you put on your attachment. And we, it comes with actually two attachments that I'm going to show you in a moment what you're getting. And then you put everything into your slow cooker. You attach the lid on like this. And then you just let it set it and oh. forget it. It does, it does all just the work for you. Just as easy as that. And just so, if we can just take a look here while we're already looking at our crock pot. First of all, look at this beautiful stainless steel finish. Yeah, we love stainless steel Isn't in the kitchen. Isn't that gorgeous? So this is going, during the winter months, it's going to stay on your countertop because you're going to feel like having comfort food. Now what you do is you, it's very easy to use this crock pot. You basically have the option of high for four hours or six hours, or you can put it on your low for eight hours or 10 hours. And at the end of the cycle, it just goes to a warm setting. So when you get home, it's your meal, your recipe, is going to be cooked okay. and ready to eat. And the aroma in your house is going to smell. Oh, it's lovely, delicious. isn't it? Yes. So how would you know whether to put it on a high setting or a low setting? Is that kind okay. of for meat or vegetables? Well, if you're or... doing it overnight, it depends on the recipe. So if you go, there's various slow cooking recipe books out there. But typically, let's say I made, I made this chili here. So it took me around, I left it overnight for eight hours on a low setting. So in the morning, it was ready. It was Perfect. ready to go. So if you're a busy person working, you're going to prepare it the night before. Yeah, of course. Put you it are. in your slow cooker, yeah. and then it's going to be ready. So eight hours. Perfect. You know, I could have done with this this morning yes. because I kind of half made a dish this yes. morning. But I, 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 you know, I'm staying with my sister at the moment who lives here yes. in Canada, and I didn't have a slow cooker, and I thought. Well, I can't leave the oven on all day. Yes. So I kind of half cooked it yes. and then took it out. And I'm going to have to carry on half cooking it again later on. But well, that, that's all good. You know. you know, with the slow cooker, you can't go wrong. And you were mentioning if you're at home and you want a quick meal, let's say it's the weekend, well, then put it on a, a high setting for four to six hours. It depends on the recipe. Yeah. So if it's like a meat, um, the, the larger your meat that you're cooking, whether it's a chicken, the longer it's going to cook. Now, this is a beef stew, a hearty beef stew. This could be chicken stew. Oh, this could be any good. stew. And you see here, we have this, this I stir crock pot. It has the stirring mechanism. So you really need to get this because what it's going to do is it's going to stir for you. So the first two hours that um, you, the recipe is cooking, it's not going to stir. So after the first two hours, what is going to happen is it's going to stir for you every half, half an hour for five minutes. Oh, brilliant. So you're going to have a fully cooked meal. It's going to be very easy to clean up this crock. I'm just going to put the lid on here. It's a glass lid, so because you don't have to constantly open it and close it, to stir it, because yeah. you would do that well, during you would the do. day. Yeah, with you a regular would. slow cooker. It's going to cook faster. That's ah, what I found. Yeah. Okay, so this, this is actually, can we just go over to show sure. the unit and what you're actually getting? So we have our stew. We have the chili that I just showed you mm -hmm. um, using both paddles here. Yep. So this is the crock pot. If it's not crock pot, it's not the original slow cooker. Yeah, that's very true. Right? And there are slow cookers, and then there's crock pots, okay. let's be honest. So, yes. 
The crock pot is very well made. So what you're getting here from the iStir, you have a choice of your all per, your general purpose paddle that you just attach just like this easily. It, it goes on easily and comes off easily. And this would be for your uh, your stews. Mm -hmm. Or actually this would be for your soup and your chili. Ah. And then if you have like a really thick stew, it comes with the thinner paddle just like this. And all you do is you turn it on. And if you want to stir while you're cooking it, you have that option to manually stir it. Oh, so if you're sitting at home and you're thinking, oh, I think it could do with a bit of a turn, you don't yes. have to wait. You can just press the button and that, it stirs it. That's correct. Or you program it. Absolutely that's brilliant. That's right. Should we, um, let, let's have a little look. We've got a video showing uh, quite a lot of the features and, and the benefits, of course, okay. that you're getting with this. We'll, uh, okay. we'll, we'll take a look at it. As we said, it is the original crock pot, of yes. course. You know, this this is the, the Rolls Royce of slow cookers, of course. Yes. Uh, if you, if you, do you know what? Even if you live by yourself, if you've managed your life and you're cooking, without one yes. of these so far I guarantee you I had one back at home get it and you will it just makes your life so much easier yes. you can do two or three dishes throw everything in there you don't need to worry about cooking when you come home from work no. it's there the house smells fabulous freeze the leftovers yeah. this is um, with feed this big pot seven people Wow. 24 around 24 cups yeah. you would get from this. That's so, a lot of food. Yeah, it would feed seven people or just maybe two or three really, really greedy people and like you know, me. And you know, traditionally... <laughs> Going back for more stuff. Oh, things. well, yes, especially me with seconds. Yeah. yeah. And if it's delicious, which it will be, you will want to go for yeah. seconds or thirds. Ex yeah. I didn't exactly. say that. We, we don't eat seconds. I didn't no. say that. And it's before, sad. I know we're going to see a video, but you're also getting included is a little dipper. And so this would be, it just keeps your... Um, gravy's warm oh. or you can put a dip in here and it will it's a warmer Great. yeah so you can just put it in cold it will warm it warm it up and keep it warm throughout your dinner or your your party if you're entertaining brilliant i well. love it it is the crock pot of course you're getting it with the bonus little dipper let's take a look at some of the features uh, that come with this amazing product Introducing the Crock-Pot Slow Cooker with iStir technology, a convenient way to automatically stir your meal, even when you're not in the kitchen. iStir technology improves the taste and texture of your dish and ensures even distribution of heat. Choose from two automatic stirring paddles that attach easily and lock into place. The general purpose paddle is great for soups and chili, and the stew paddle is ideal for thick, hearty stews. Once the digital control is set, iStir technology self-activates after two hours and continues to stir every 30 minutes to ensure thorough cooking. And since the food is being stirred, buildup and burnt edges on the stoneware wall are reduced, minimizing the need for any scrubbing during cleanup. The stoneware, paddles, and lid without motor can be placed in the dishwasher for easy cleanup. Unique iStir technology makes it easy to create your next tasty meal. Exclusively from the Crock-Pot brand, the original slow cooker. Love it. How do you live without a oh, Crock-Pot? Oh, look how delicious this is here. I'm telling you, if you're, even if you're on your own, you, do you know what? Isn't this a great idea? I can understand, you know, people out there saying, well, you know, I don't have a big family. Maybe my kids have left home or it's just me and my husband or it's just me and the dog or the cat or whatever. But, you know, even if you're by yourself, the beauty of this is that most of us have a, a something to do in our lives, whether it's you have to go to work, you have to go out, you've got to walk the dog. Maybe you're not that mobile and you don't want to be standing in the kitchen for hours yes. on end preparing a meal. Well, stick it all in your crock pot. That is it. That is all you need to do. I do this all the time. Honestly, I did this yesterday, did it the day before. You put it all in, you let it cook in the crock pot, and I tell you what, food, this isn't just me making this up, food that is slow cooked and eaten when it's been slow cooked for oh. eight to ten hours, the meat is so oh. much more tender. Yes. And the flavors have been enriched. Because if you think about it, make a stew. You can, if you want to, on the stove, make a stew in, in what, 20, 30 minutes? Yes. You can use the microwave a bit. You can use, you know, the heat a bit, whatever. You can make it in 30 minutes. But it doesn't taste the same as the stew that we're looking at now that, that Bruce oh. is practically salivating our yes. camera. I can see him always dribbling behind the camera because it smells incredible. It's been cooked Look at this. for 10 minutes. Hours. Oh yes, this stew yeah. was cooked for 10 hours. So you would just hours. prepare it and overnight, you, you'd you prepare it the night before and yeah. overnight. Or in the morning, on the yeah. weekend or your day off, 
and then it's ready for That's it. supper. You know what, if you don't think you have time to cook because you're working during the day, you do, trust me. You throw it in the crock pot in the morning, you switch it on, it stirs itself throughout the day. You go out the door, you spend your day doing whatever you're doing, working, shopping, anything else. You come home to dinner and boom, it is done, it's there. The house smells fabulous. Oh and it tastes even better. And what I love about this, you're getting the bonus little dipper, but mm. also the thing that I think, I'm gonna have to get one of these now. Um, having had a crock pot at home, I didn't have one that stirred itself. Well, it's Kathy, fantastic. It's amazing. And you made a really good point. Meat, meat becomes so tender. <sighs> and you can actually buy those less expensive cuts yes. of meat, so you can save yourself money. And you can also, it's tender, it's juicy, like if you have a delicious roast, which I'll be showing you in a moment. So, and once again, so this is the icer. Now watch this, look at this turning here. So this is going to happen automatically in your slow cooker. So prep time takes approximately 10 to 20 minutes depending on your recipe. Go online, tons of recipes online or get yourself a, a slow cooker cookbook as well. You know, you can do more than just stews. There's so many oh, different course, types yeah. of meat dishes. You can make breakfast. You can yep. make drink. Actually, if you stay with me, I'm going to show you more ideas as well. You know, you can make anything. You can make anything that you would normally make, yeah. you know, in the oven or in a frying pan. You can make any of those things in a slow cooker. It's that simple. You yes. just put all the same ingredients in. You leave it to do its thing. And this stirs itself. So if you're making something, as we can see here, that's got a little bit more liquid, a soup or anything oh, like that. Oh, this is so good. It's going to stir itself throughout the day. And, you know, we raised a valid point before. If you are on a bit of a tight budget, most of us are, you know, the prices in the supermarkets, the grocery stores are getting higher and higher and yeah. higher. You know, those cheaper cuts of meat will never taste better than they have tasted 10 hours cooking with the juices and the vegetables and the spices in a crock pot. Oh, yes. By the way, can I just mention, sorry, we um, we are incredibly busy still on those phone lines from the yes. previous hour. The showstopper, those mucklucks are flying out of the door. We've sold out in the uh, in the black, I'm afraid. Please go to tsc.ca if you want to, uh, to get them uh, even more quickly. Just, you know, go online, stick them in a basket, check out, or please just wait for us. We're there. We're on the phone lines. one 2020 triple eight. Yes. Now, Kathy, okay. what have you done so here? So this is a chowder. This oh. is a delicious bacon, chicken, potato, corn chowder. All made in the crock pot. We have the oyster. Yeah. That's I what have, I'm looking for. I'm I looking have, for a spoon. Oh, oh, you need a spoon. I'm looking for a spoon. Here, here you go, Bruce my Bruce has got my number, here I'm you telling go. you. Do you know, I was, we were are. standing here and, and I'm going... Like oh, no. this. Bruce says, you just need a spoon. I said, that's what I was looking Bruce for. Bruce is drilling over there. <laughs> There we go. That is that so just? Good. Isn't that fantastic? This is like, I'm just gonna have one more bit. Sorry. Yes. Just having just having my dinner. It's, you know. Yeah. <laughs> There's a lot. There's stew that here. Is so good. We have chili that we made with our mm. oyster. And you know something? This. Look at the size of this. Look at the size. Beautiful stainless steel finish. Yeah. Oh, I know we only have a few seconds left. Look at this roast. So you don't Whoa. you you have the option of using the oyster, the stirring mechanism. I made a roast in here. Look at all the natural juices. It's so tender. It's you're not going no more. You're gonna have the dried out meat in here. Yeah, it's because juicy and tender. it's juicy. It's tender. You've got the natural juice in here, and it's just perfect oh, I love for it. an afternoon Sunday mm -hmm. afternoon with the family. Oh yes, it's worth saying. By the way, it's a really valid point. Of course, this does come with the Ister technology that you know it's gonna stir it for you during the day. But if you don't want it to do that, as Kathy said, if you're putting a joint of meat or anything like yes. that into it, you can take the ice off, it just clicks in and out of place.